Now that I have my Postgres drivers installed, let's just do a couple checks to make sure that the connection will actually be established. The first thing I want to do is to make sure that I have an instance of Postgres running on my machine. And for that, I use an app called DB Engine. And we can see right here that I have Postgres currently running on my machine. And I already went in and I added a new database to Postgres and I called it Movies. Okay, so let's go ahead and open up our project in IntelliJ. In the folder structure, let's expand config. And under config, we see that there's a database.ts file. Let's go ahead and open that up. If we scroll down a bit, we can see the Postgres information right in the center here. What I'll do now is go ahead and update some of this information to reflect the actual connection that I'll have with my Postgres server. The first thing I want to change is my user. The user I'm using is named Postgres. And let's remove the password and change the database name from Lucid to Movies. One other thing I want to change too is health check. According to the Adonis documentation, one way that you could check the connection with your database server is to use this health check option. So I'm going to change that from false to true. Then I'm going to go ahead and go to routes.ts. Now let's import the health check library and a new route. Okay, let's just go ahead and use the terminal and then run the command node ace serve dash dash watch to run our application. And well, it looks like we have an error here where we need to import the proxy address from proxy dash address. To install that missing package, let's go ahead and run npm install proxy address. Okay, let's go ahead and run node a serve watch again and see if that resolved the issue. Okay, it looks like it's building successfully. And we now have our app running on port 000 colon 3333. And let's go ahead and add forward slash health. Okay, awesome. This lets us know that we've established a connection with our local database server.